Let's break down game four between the Mavs and the Timberwolves. The Timberwolves were in a tough spot, right? They were down 3-0 in the series, which means they hadn't won a single game against the Mavs yet. But in game four, they turned things around and snagged a win. But how did they do it? First off, the Timberwolves stars, Anthony Edwards and Carl Anthony Towns, really stepped up. They played with a lot of energy and made some big shots. It's like they knew they had to bring their A game, and they did. Here's what Luka Doncic, Jason Kidd, and Anthony Edwards has to say after the game. That game is on me. I uh, just didn't give enough energy, uh, so we gotta do better. They won one game, uh, we just gotta focus on the next one. Always gotta believe. Uh, I believed in the end. Uh, it was close at the end, but we couldn't. Uh, so they won the game, like I said. We just gotta focus on the next one. For Minnesota, they, you know, they got to the free throw line early in that first quarter. Um, but I thought, again, we uh, took a stand, and in that second quarter, we started to play uh, better on both ends. Just understanding the third quarter, we came out, you know, first and third, we were not very good you know, tonight. So we'll look at that to see how we can be better. But the second and fourth, put ourselves in a position to uh, win the game. But, you know, we got to be better for four quarters, and you get uh, Minnesota credit. They came out and, and fought and found a way to win. You talked about how are you seeing for game six. Where does that confidence come from? Um, what am I supposed to say? I'm supposed to say um, we're going to lose game five? No, I'm not going to never say that. Um, Michael Parsons, you know, he was rocking the AE1s, and I told him he wears size 14. I'll bring back some nice now, shoes for, for the six, adjustments. That's what I told him. The Timberwolves changed their defense to focus more on Luka Doncic and Kyrie Irving, the Mavs' top players. They tried different ways to slow them down, like double-teaming them. This made it harder for Luka and Kyrie to score and helped the Timberwolves control the game's pace. These changes also meant that the Timberwolves could force the Mavs to take tougher shots, and they didn't let them get easy points. Plus, the Timberwolves were really smart about not turning the ball over, which means they didn't make many mistakes that the Mavs could use to score easily. Looking ahead, this win is a big deal for the Timberwolves. It shows they can adjust their strategy and beat the Mavs. It'll give them confidence for the next games, and they'll probably keep using the same tactics that worked in Game 4. If they keep playing like this, they could make a comeback in the series. It's all about keeping that momentum going and sticking to what works.